Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Uncharted 4 Myths, the video series where you send me questions and I investigate whether or not the myths are true. First myth, it is possible to play all of Crash Bandicoot in Uncharted. This myth is now busted. That myth is not true. It is impossible to play all the levels of Crash Bandicoot in Uncharted 4. That's all we have time for today, guys. Thanks for watching, and be sure to tell a friend today that Yandere Depp from the Cub Scouts is that dude. <laughs> Over the past several weeks, I have worked tirelessly to implement Rivals into Yandere Simulator. But due to the endless amount of emails I get every day, it looks as though it might take a few more months, even a year, to fully implement a new rival. I made a poll asking you all what should be my next move. Most of you getting massive yawn boners at the thought of Rivals, so I decided fuck it, who needs sleep and started coding away. While working on the full functionality of Osana, a genius elimination method popped into my head. What would be the best way to hide evidence besides a furnace or a grinder? Dogs, and not a poodle or chihuahua, but a Doberman. A Doberman would maul and eat the corpse of a student, which results in a very gruesome and action-packed death, just the way I like it. But come Deb, come Deb, animal lovers are going to go apeshit at the thought of you using an animal as a weapon. Remember when they lost their shit at potential kitten killing? Well, I'm Cub Dev, and I want a Doberman elimination method, goddammit. Okay. So now that you know of the progress of the rivals in the new elimination method, the last thing I want to say is stop sending suggestions to my email. A suggestion to give Coconut even bigger boobs or make the nurse's booty bigger is not helpful to the development of the game. Telling me the exact steps to report a bug or glitch is helpful, and it lets me know that people can follow simple instructions. But anyway, enough of the negative stuff. A new build will be available every 1st and 15th of each month, so expect a new build video to be out soon. And as always, thank you for following the development of Yandere Simulator.